Uh, hello, um, MIT 240 students. I'm now about to show you how you can create a part four from your homework uh, four, which is positioning stop. So first, make sure you're at the right place by going to project and checking are you at the right path. And then start a new part by uh, selecting English and standard inches, create. And now I'm, I'm about to show you how to create this part. So I will create this part by create, starting with the block 4.0, uh, 2.5 by uh, 0 0.25. So it will be one box. And then I'll remove this side, this triangle, and this triangle. And then I will make these three holes. So uh, I will create a two-dimensional sketch. And I will choose, I will go here, origin. And I can select this one. And I'll start with rectangle, and this is symmetrical part. I mean, I could start with rectangle around this, but we will have another chapter related to symmetrical part. So I'll start with 0, 0. And I will dimension this, so one will be 4 inches, and the other one will be 2.5. 2.5, enter. Middle mouse key twice, so I can zoom everything in. And that's all I need. And I, then I'll do finish sketch and again middle mouse key twice. And I'll extrude this to be uh, 0 0.25 like this. So I'll start with these two rectangular shapes. You see I have here this dimension 1.75. And how do I know where this ends? Uh -huh, I have this 1.25 in the middle. Okay, so I'll add two lines and then I have 1.25. Okay, so I'll go create two dimensional sketch in this plane and I will make two lines. One somewhere here. And then again, I will make the other line somewhere here. And then I would like to say that from here to the other one here, I have this 1.25 like that and here from here to there I have 1.75 and I would like this to be symmetric so I can either add here another 1.75 or I can create another line somewhere here in the middle and in that line I would like to be construction so I can select construction here and make it vertical Oh, this one is not really vertical, so I will use vertical and make sure it's vertical. Right now it is. And now I can use the symmetry, and I might say that maybe right side and right side, and this would be in the middle. Yeah, this doesn't want to listen to me since... Okay, so let's, let's say the symmetry, this point and this point, I like them to be symmetrical with my line okay and then this point this point and to be symmetrical with this line so you see now I don't need any more constraints since I added this to be symmetrical so symmetry feature feature and then the center line and I can finish my sketch and I can extrude and I can select this one and this one and I would like to make them cut and I can say here through all Okay, and now I would like to create a hole in, um, so I have these two smaller holes, you see this one here and I have this one here. So, I mean I could create, um, if, if my rectangular shape was in the middle then I could use the mirror option, but or maybe I can create just three holes in one sketch. But let me create this hole with the whole option. So 0 0.75, 0 0.75, and diameter is 0 0.5. So I can say hole here, and it should be 0 0.5. And then I would like to use a first reference from here to be 0 0.75. And I would like to use a second reference from here, 0 0.75. And that's it. Okay. And I can make the other one the same same way. So the face is this one. 
it's 0 0.5 my first reference is this one 0 0.75 and the other reference is here 0 0.75 and that's it, I have the other hole. And now I need to create the, the one in the middle. So you see it's 1.25 and it is in the middle, so this is 2 and this is 1.25. So uh, hole, this is the plane, this would be 1.25 and I have a reference this one which is 1.25 and then I'll go from here by 2. So that's all you had to do for this part. And make sure you save that. I didn't save the... I think if I copy... It, it, this is positioning stop. And then your first, your last name. So that was it.